Hi guys, my name is Marcela and today I want to show you my night cleaning routine for an easy morning. Okay, so my first tip for you is to do your dishes every single night. I know that we have all come from a busy day and a long day of work and taking care of the kids and all that. But believe me, if you don't take care of your dishes the night before, all is going to happen is that you are going to wake up to a sink full of dirty dishes for you to take care of before starting to prepare your breakfast for your kids and your family. So it's much better to take care of them the night before so you can wake up to a very easy day. Along with the dishes, of course, you take care of the pots and pans and also the stove. The stove gets like spilled with food and while we're preparing and if you don't take care of that right away, what it's going to happen is that it will accumulate the grease over and over. So all you have to do after that is to do a deep clean of the stove. So to avoid that, just take care of the spills as they go. My next tip is that you take care of everything from the counter. Take all that away, put it on its place if you have like dishes or like salt and pepper and things that you are not going to use it on a daily basis. Just clean that up, give a good wipe down and make sure that nothing is on the way for the next morning so that way it'll be easier for you again to prepare breakfast for your family and to make everything in a quick and easy way the next morning. My other tip is for you to look around the house for things that don't belong where they are. For example, if you see toys in the living room and they don't belong there, or if you see a cup on your desk from some water that you may have taken during the day, or like a coffee mug on your desk and it doesn't belong there, it's easier for you to take care of all that the night before and again the next morning it will be much easier and stress free. Another thing that I like to do is fluff the pillows from my sofa. You know, we've been sitting there watching TV and they look like so like flat and they don't look nice. So I like to fluff them. And I also want to make sure that the throw or the blanket that I have on my sofa will be nicely folded on one of the arms. I also like to give like a quick wipe down of the sofa. You know, I have a dog and he sheds a lot. So I kind of like do a, a downed cloth or a downed sponge just to make sure that I get all that extra fur from my dog and everything looks so nice when I wake up in the morning. I kind of like wake up to a clean house the next day. I work from home, so I have my desk right next to my living room. I don't like to leave everything open on my desk because the next morning is just like stressful to see all that messiness over there. So the way I do it is I bring all of the papers that I'm working on, I put it in a folder, all my notebooks, I close them and put it right next to each other, like one on top of each other. And then I close my laptop and make sure that nothing is on top of my desk other than just my laptop and a few notebooks that I'm still working on, but in a nice, organized way. I'll put all the pens and pencils in a pencil cup holder and everything will be so much nicer when I wake up in the morning and I'm ready to do a whole new day of work. I will also give a quick sweep of the floors, especially in the kitchen because there are like crumbs and rest of food that might have fallen while eating. So I give like a quick, quick 
sweeping or swiffer on the floors so that way the next morning I don't have to step on dirty floors. I usually don't mop the floors at night, but if, ne if it is necessary, I will in case that I spill some food, so I don't want that to stain the floor. So I'll give a quick uh, mopping if it's necessary. Otherwise, a quick sweeping is just fine. The other thing that I like to do is to give a quick wipe down of the sink. I like to empty the drainer and the colander that is right there so I avoid it to get clogged and I will put some powder and also a little bit of vinegar so I can disinfect it every night. I make a mix of half part of vinegar and half water and I have that handy to clean it overnight. Then I wipe it down thoroughly always on the same grain, on the grain of the um, stainless steel so it doesn't get any scratches. And then I'm going to rinse it off. I will use the water on the highest cycle so that way I can eliminate bacteria and that kind of stuff. So that's better and it will also dry faster at the same time. And speaking of drying, I will get a cloth to clean or to dry the faucet around and also inside the sink. And finally, I'll make sure that my baby boy has enough food and also fresh water for him to drink overnight. And that's it. That is my night cleaning routine. I do this every single night and I promise you, if you follow these very simple steps, you will wake up in the next morning to a much fresher and organized house. Making your mornings stress-free and quick and easy, you will be able to get out of the house. If you liked this video, please give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe and share it with all your friends. And if you would like to see more of these kind of videos, please let me know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.